Boker Tov Shavu Tov to everyone. Gabriel Shur, Chazak Baruch, amazing job. Uh, okay, we learned yesterday. Actually, this from Rav Baruch Kazir. He gave me good chiddush. He says why Moshe Rabenu prayed 515 times. If he would pray 516, he would go to Eretz Yisrael. How do we know? And uh, what is the prayer? So according to some, they explain. They say. That was Tefillat Mincha of Shabbat. This is according to Pnei Yeshua. And some say that was Kaddish. Check the first letters of Kaddish. Yid Gadal, Beit Kaddash, Shmei Rabam. Yid Gadal, first letter is Yud. Beit Kaddash. By the way, the person says Kaddish, be careful. Some people say Yid Gadal. Yid Gadal. Gadol. Okay? Yid Gadal, Yud. And Beit Kaddash, Vav. Yud is 10. Vav is 616. Shmei. Shin. 300, 316, and Rabba Resh, 200, 516. So if Moshe Rabbeinu would say Kaddish, he would enter it. So we see from here, Kaddish is very, very important tefillah, very holy prayer. So it says, Yes, Lechaven, Baniyat, Kaddish, Na'anot, Amen, Bekol. When you hear Kaddish, you have to say Amen with your voice, not Amen. But you can't say louder than the Chazan himself. A person who says Kaddish with you or makes bracha, you're not allowed to say Amen louder than bracha than the person who made bracha. Foolish. Kaddish. Person should run, hurry to shul, to be on time to answer Kaddish. Whoever answers Amen with all his might, with all his strength, Korim lo gizad dinosh and shemim shana for seventy years, whatever decree goes on his Allah and his family, he cuts it off. Tours it away. So why do we say a little bit loud? Yes, one person talking. What it does, it includes kavanot. Even though you should be loud, you cannot be too loud. So a person who makes bracha or says kaddish with you should not get disturbed. The person answers Amen Yashmer Abba too loud that people say, It Gadal, it Gadal, and you say, Amen! Like, you know, it becomes like as if you're making a joke out of it. And that is Isur. That's not allowed to be done. Even though you have to say a little bit loud, but with all your kavana, with your intention, strength. But with all your kavana, with your intention, strength. But don't say it too loud. The pillars, yesh me raba. What does that mean, yesh me raba murach? Hainu sheyesh mo shal kadosh baruch hu shalem. You want Hashem's name to be complete. Hashem said, as long as Amalek is alive, my name is not complete. My chair is not complete. She nishba kadosh baruch hu. Hashem swore, hu shelo yu shmo vekiso shlemim at shem chesh mo shal Amalek. Hashem said, my name is not complete until the name of Amalek is destroyed. Let's say you're praying by Kotel Maravi, you know, every three minutes, different minyan. You're praying and you're saying Ashray, let's say. And somebody in different minyan says, Kaddish, you're allowed to answer? The answer is yes. The answer is yes. Since this is the play, you're allowed to answer Amen. You're allowed to answer Amen from different minyan. No problem. Okay. 